Hi guys, and welcome to my very first Bujo plan with me. I've never tried keeping a bullet journal before, but I decided it's time to experiment, and so I'm going to make my first ever weekly spread. I'm going to be using this Stalogy 365 A5 notebook. I have used this in the past a few times as a daily planner, but I decided because this is just an experiment, I would rather not use a new notebook. And this is ideal because it has a grid layout, but the grid is quite faint, so it's easy to ignore. So, I am going to start by dividing the page horizontally in half, which is made a lot easier by the fact that it has these hourly lines. I am absolutely terrible at making straight lines, even with a ruler, so this is probably not going to look great, but whatever, it's just for fun. So we've got a weekly layout, more or less, and now I'm going to use these Erin Condren markers that I got at PlannerCon Europe to label the days. All of my planners have Monday starts, but I'm thinking that a Sunday start would be kind of interesting because in my head, the, the first work day of my week is Sunday, so it would actually kind of make sense to have a Sunday start. Saturday is my day off. Okay. All right, now, on Sunday, I am going to Copenhagen. Thursday and Friday will be dedicated to a university administrative paperwork and on Thursday I'd like to go to Earthlings Experience at 7 so I'll put that down at the bottom because I'm not sure what will come up in the meantime Friday paperwork and then Shabbat I have the day off and that's it for now in terms of fixed plans this is actually quite an empty week for plans because it's reading week which means that there are no classes at university and that's why I'm going away on this field work trip so I will put a little star next to that and a little star next to my flight home and a little star next to the Earthlings experience. Okay, so that is my first ever attempt at a Bujo weekly spread. I have to say I really enjoyed making this. It's very basic, very simple, not very artistic, but I really enjoyed the splashes of color and I enjoyed being able to customize the week. So we will see what happens and whether I continue making these or not. So I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye! Greetings and welcome to uh, my plan with me, aka man with me. I've chosen Lily's uh, Batman journal planner. Uh, I think she was using this as a list day day to day planning something or other. Anyway, I'm going to use this for my Bujo, my, my custom Bujo. Um, we're going to fit seven days, starting with today, Saturday. Today's Saturday, the 10th of February. It's a bit unorthodox starting on a Saturday, but this is really a fun project, so let's do it. Um, I guess we want to put the names of the days. Or maybe, maybe, maybe we should divide. Maybe we should divide it up into seven sections first. Uh, let's think. One, two, three, four. Okay, let's do this. Okay, so as we can see, I've made a bit of a dog's dinner of this. <laughs> Firstly, I accidentally got my finger in the path of the pen. It's kind of got squished over by the ruler, but that doesn't matter. That doesn't matter. We take, we take it easy. The second problem is that I've kind of miscalculated the, uh, the, this, the spatial arrangement. 
So let's say we've got Saturday, Sunday, Monday, massive day on Tuesday, <laughs> Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, uh, uh, and this is, this is just for notes. Let, 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 let's write here notes. Uh, we'll use a different pen. Right. Um, let's, let's get decorating this. I've got these, these superhero stickers. Um, we'll do the important things first. Oh, here we go. Straight away, I can see Commissioner Gordon. Let's put him in the notes section. Oh yeah, looking good. Right. <laughs> I suppose I should put days of the week. I'm wondering if maybe this is a bit... This giant Tuesday is a bit elaborate. Let's, let's shrink this down and then we'll have some more space for notes. <coughs> or maybe, maybe, maybe some kind of goals. We can have a goal on here. So let's shrink down Tuesday and, and we can do something else with the real estate. See, I've put a little exclamation mark next to uh, next to Friday. It's a serious planner, but there's there's always time for some fun and games. Now, what we're gonna what we're gonna do with this? Um, see, we have notes. Um, we can use this for some kind of tracker. Uh, what kind of tracker would be suitable in a in a man planner? I'm thinking. Um, um, what what? Maybe, um, what do I do? What do I do on a daily basis that I'd like to track? Enemies defeated. Number of en enemies defeated. I suppose I could record that in the, in, in the uh, individual days. Um, what about weekly goals? Weekly goals. Okay, um... I think it's time for some more stickers. So Lily's going away on a Sunday, so I'm going to put this sticker alone. That's going to be me. Um, but I'm dropping her at the airport for when she has to go. Um, what I get up to while she's away is going to be a secret. And uh, when she comes back on Tuesday, it's going to be cool. Um, let's see what else we got. Some dog stickers. The, the idea that this is training. The idea that our dogs ever do any training is kind of comical. Um, let's put another one of that because we've got two dogs. Uh, Tuesday I've got a doctor's appointment so I really want to use a I'm gonna use this priority sticker priority um, okay so my weekly goal this week is to let's let, let's, let's try and do a, a, a fun font have fun. We'll try and do this uh, this this kind of planner font that everybody uses. Let's see if I can replicate this. That's not very good. Um, oh, I've just remembered. Black Panther is coming out on Tuesday. That's my other priority. Let's do a little picture of a panther. Notes. Don't forget to see black panther. I should also write, don't forget to pick Lily up at the airport, but um, I suspect she'll remind me about that. Um, what, up, what else can we track? Um, I want to track something fun. Uh, what, about, what about the fastest speed I do in my car? That's probably irresponsible. Um, 
exercise maybe. I feel like if I tracked exercise this would be a pretty empty week. Uh, do exercise. Do some exercise. Uh, what else can we do? Let's use one of these little arrows to show what day it is. Today is currently Saturday. Um, best day ever. What about water tracking? People do that. People do that, don't they? Water tracking. So, what are you supposed to drink? Like three liters of water? Let's uh, let's 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 do the the, the water. We, each time I uh, have a drink of water, I'll fill I'll fill this in. And now uh, with this orange pen, we can do beer tracking. So uh, I, my friend's coming to visit on Friday, so we'll do a we'll do a beer tracker. Um, I'll colour this in for each beer that we drink. That's a bit optimistic. Um, I'll, I'll do a couple of Jack Daniels ju just in, just in case. I guess I can do a rating system for Black Panther. There we go. <laughs> I, I will colour in the number of uh, the number of. <laughs> Boxes. If it's a five out of five, I'll color. I'll color in all five boxes. Um, if it's no good, I'll just color in one or two. What else can we track? Something to do with sleep, maybe. Um, Okay, so I can fill this in. Excitingly, I can fill in last night's sleep because I actually got eight hours of sleep, which is quite unusual for me. And uh, I think I deserve a, um, I think I deserve a sticker for that because it's the first time in quite a long time I've had eight hours. Yes. Um, okay, I think that's it. Let's. Uh, I got my my orange sticker ready. Let's. Let's move ahead with the week.